are just a couple houses on left, mostly the condominiums, and there is the Atlantic Ocean behind. And uh, scooter running great. You can see almost 40 miles per hour, which is great. And here, here is a White Street Pier or Ice Molo. Ocean is kind of calm. I was expecting more rough because it was a storm through the night. Here is the watch post playground. And uh, yeah, this is a White Street Pier. to slow down it's 15 miles per hour I did almost 25 let's get here I will park next to this golf cart and I'll show you pretty ugly thing but it's nature so yesterday night we had a we had a storm here like around midnight and for last month everybody keeps saying that it's uh, it's uh, so much seaweed coming here so you can see it's like piles of seaweed everywhere and the ocean is dirty it's low tide right now, I can tell. Some people are swimming, but you can see it's not nice and clean at all. This is Casa Marina, and this is a Hicks Beach. This is a small pier, it's almost new, they just repaired the old one. And over there, it's White Street. Here. So we will go this way because uh, over there is a southernmost point. So we will go see there. So um, what I want to show you it's Key West Marine Park and Snorkel Trail. And this is where we are right now. And this is actually the Reynolds Street, this one. So we were on a Reynolds Street Pier. This is a White Street Pier and a fishing pier. That's where I'm mostly streaming my fishing. West Marcello Tower, and all the way. We will go around Dog Beach. I will show it to you. And this is the southernmost point. Still the Casa Marina. Let's make the left turn. And here is a small place. I actually don't know the name of it. And I just want to show you how does it looks like here. I'll leave a scooter here for one minute. I will not have a problem with the police or something. And as you can see, here is so many seagrass. It's everywhere. The seaweed 
and the trash and everything from here so come on people keep the ocean clean this is disgusting Terrible, terrible. So you can spend night in some of these resorts with a beautiful ocean view. The first thing what you see in the morning is this and I can explain the smell of it but it's really bad. <laughs> So here is a dog beach, it's on the corner of Vernon and Vedel Avenue, uh, that's the one and only place here where are the pets loaded to go, so you can take your dog to the beach, on a dog beach. So now we are on a south street. Here is Tipsy Rooster and Rooster Treats. That's uh, a place of our friends. If you wanna have a really good ice cream or mini donuts, visit them. And if you wanna have a good drink, go to Tipsy Rooster. It's a corner of uh, South Street and Simon. Now we will have a green light and I already can see the southernmost point buoy. So let's go there. Let's see how many people are there waiting in a line to get a picture with the southernmost point of United States. I was watching a video of, of some guy who was visiting Key West and and this is what happened always with the Miami drivers they have a stop sign I was the first one so it's always good to check all the drivers around you because not bunch of them are smart here so here is a southernmost point we actually on uh, the house across the street it's a uh, it's a live webcam so you can go online and, uh, and uh, you can see what's going on here so back to back to the guy he says that uh, in his video that the, the buoy was repainted after Irma, which is kind of true, but it was actually repainted, I don't know, like a year ago again, because two stupid drunk guys put a Christmas tree on it and burned the Christmas tree. So all the, the fire, burn the paint on a, on a buoy too so yeah it's it's repaint here is Kives lighthouse you can see people on the top uh, this is mortuary Kives mortuary I don't know if I'm spelling correctly but that's the place of the of the that people, I don't know how to say it. We call it Marnice. So here is a Kives lighthouse. Hi. And across the street, it's a Hemingway house. So this is Hemingway house. Right here. So. I just used the Petronia Street. Here is a Blue Haven restaurant. Famous breakfast. And La Craperie here. That's a French place. And 
we will go this is like really really like old town downtown so we will go all the way to almost for Zachary and actually I will not go to, to for Zachary beach because I don't have reason to go there and spending money for nothing because we will not stay there so this is a soccer field in front of us that's actually the older one and here is a new one here is the new one it's beautiful it's artificial grass there you can see it's a very really nice place so here is uh, Florida Keys Eco Discovery Center uh, they open Friday and Saturday only I remember they were closed like Monday Tuesdays so they were open from uh, from uh, Wednesday till Saturday or Sunday. This is amphitheater there are where the most concerts are happen. And here you can see beach, Fort Zachary Taylor State Park. So if you go where the the silver Toyota is, there is a gate, so you pay some small fee. Uh, actually it's here so you can see how much you have to pay and you can go you can go there she let us go nice and let's go back so this is place for a concert eco discovery center it's beautiful because you can see how the the all the the, the pets uh, and animals and everything fish birds and I don't know what else are live here so there is a cinema there is some displays with a beautiful thing uh, there is actually like a submarine that you can go in and you can so see the underwater life on the big screens and we will go to see um, Ingram which was the warship and after was the coast guard ship now it's in retirement and it's parking here here we are this is a Ingram it was a warship in World War II and it's a museum inside so if you go inside they give you the headphones and uh, it's, it's, it looks like like the, the war that happened yesterday inside the boat it's, it's really nice and it's really worth it to go there and see all the things inside and they told me that this this boat hit, uh, hit the, the sub, uh, no submarine yeah submarine the German submarine with the torpedo so at least it had has uh, one hit and we have another coast guard boat there which is not usually parking over there so maybe something something strange happened I don't know I can't tell we have some other container boat over there which is uh, this is a uh, government property it's like army complex. Navy, sorry. Navy. And we have another boat there. I can see the boat there. I can see the boat. Uh, we have a cruise ship here. Cruise ship. Ships, you 
Fulgenci Sunsetki Sunsetki because the sunset is always this way This is it And let's continue So we are on a Whitehead Street uh, this white building on my right side, this one it's a, it's a restaurant right now, it's called First Flight and it was the first office of uh, Pan American Airlines and later it was uh, Kelly's restaurant and the owner former owner of this place was nobody else than uh, the Kelly McGillis from the movie Top Gun so this is a famous place too here you can see you can climb on a shipwreck museum all the way on the top they have a small tower and Behind there is a Key West Aquarium So you can see the Key West Aquarium too They have actually some new program there I heard some new displays uh, We will go here In front of us is Meloy Square One of the good places To Watching the sunset of Key West we were on the south on the Higgs Beach and this is opposite side this is the northern side so here is a Mallory Square this, uh, you can see the, the same, same cruise ship like I showed you before and before the sunset in the evenings here is a lot of artists uh, and and uh, some street street producers or what is the name they doing their show here and you pay them so now I'll go straight here because there is no any other option and we will ride through the Duval Street Duval Street is the famous place it's something like Stodoni in Ostrava it's a place with a bunch of bunch of pubs restaurants and nightlife clubs so here we are on Duval I will do the video through the day and I will do the video through the night this is Slappy Joe's bar it's uh, one of the famous places Here is a nightclub, strip club or something like that on the right. Bull, bunch of famous places. So here on the left side is uh, Hard Rock Key West. Really good place, highly recommended to visit. Here, 
this is actually the old town uh, old house the oldest house on the Key West and Coast Guard's helicopter above us the oldest house is uh, kind of like a museum and it's the oldest house of the Key West here the, the building on my right it's uh, La Concha hotel and spa and I heard this is a, one of the oldest hotels in Key West so here are another local artists but they're not performing the, the best performance are on a, on a Mallory Square. This is Willities, and you can see the dollar bills all around. They are real. They have all the dollar bills on a ceiling, on a walls, posts, and everything. Uh, what else? What else? So this is a 600 block of Duval. Uh, if you ever lost yourself in Key West, you can just uh, say that you are on a on a on a block of the street, and you can see the name of the streets on every corner uh, electrical pole. So this one is Angela and Duval. So you can say that you are on a 600 block du of Duval, or you can say that you are on a corner of Duval and Angela every you see the yellow number 111 so every pole has this number so if you are in emergency and you have to call 911 uh, and they will ask you where you are and you not you don't know exactly where you are just read them the number you can read the number from the from the pole and they know that B1116 it's corner of Petronia and Duval. This is Duval House, my friend's resort. Nice people. So we are on uh, 1100 block of Duval and we go straight to southern part of the of the island and What I want to show you now, it's a butterfly museum. You see the, the glass roof over there? It's full of butterflies and uh, pelicanos and other species. So Key West butterfly. Definitely, definitely worth it to go there. It's beautiful over there. Here is the main entrance. So we're walking in this way. So beautiful there. This is a southernmost house. And I will make one more loop around the southernmost point view. And I will do the make turn, make a U-turn there and going back home. So on this building, on this building is the, the is the camera. So you can watch. You can watch. So here I will do the U-turn, and this is exactly this is exactly what is prohibited.